Let's talk about Juneteenth, a holiday dating back over 150 years. It is considered the longest-running African-American holiday. Juneteenth has been called many things. Liberation Day, Jubilee Day, Emancipation Day, Freedom Day. Celebrated for generations, but only recently declared a national holiday. Juneteenth has a long, rich tradition in our country. Until recently, it has not experienced widespread recognition. Over the last few decades, Juneteenth has experienced significant exposure across the country. The culmination of this led to June 17, 2021, when President Joe Biden officially signed the Juneteenth National Independence Day Act into law. It's commonly known that Abraham Lincoln signed the Emancipation Proclamation. President Lincoln stated, I do order and declare that all persons held as slaves within said designated states and parts of states are and henceforward shall be free. Although freedom was declared for all slaves, not all of them were free. Two years after Lincoln's proclamation, there were still some enslaved in Texas. This is the story of Juneteenth. On June 19, 1865, Union Major General Gordon Granger arrived to Galveston, Texas with 2,000 federal troops to enforce the Emancipation Proclamation. Granger, marching throughout the town declaring, the people of Texas are informed that, in accordance with the proclamation from the Executive of the United States, all slaves are free. This historic moment effectively marked the ending of slavery in Texas. In fact, June 19th was first celebrated in Texas one year later. For many celebrations of Juneteenth are rooted in their families and communities, traditions established to mark the occasion, promoting and cultivating knowledge and appreciation of the African-American history and culture. On July 4th, we celebrate our nation's Independence Day. We mark this day with beloved traditions, we gather with family and friends, have cookouts and fireworks displays. Similarly, Juneteenth is celebrated in cities across America with ceremonies to remember the end of slavery, honor the Juneteenth flag, hold prayer vigils, and host award ceremonies. Festivals and contests have become a big part of community celebrations that are centered around fellowship and food, including the holiday's long-held signature beverage, strawberry soda pop. All of us can participate in this meaningful holiday. It might start with picking up a book or visiting a museum or attending an event. At this pivotal time in history, Premier is proud to recognize this holiday. As an industry leader, we strive to lead by example. I want to encourage everyone to use this day to learn and grow. Take the time to learn both collectively and as individuals. Invite your friends, families, and communities to participate in these enriching traditions. This national holiday is dedicated to celebrating a historic moment while simultaneously allowing us to reflect on the progress yet to be made. In a way, Juneteenth honors the beginning of a journey, the journey of ideals, which as a nation, we together aspire to live up to. Juneteenth is a day for celebration, a day for reflection and restoration. June 19th is a day of deep honor. How will you honor Juneteenth? How will you honor Juneteenth?